Okay. Hi everybody, I'm Trevor. I'm Liz. And you are sailing with the care in the world. Sailing with the care in <laughs> the world. <laughs> Tell people what you're doing. Uh, well, I'm going to take the tiller off so we can take it home and sand it and re-varnish it. Because it's all ugly and gross and needs to be done. Because it make it look pretty again. Alright, sweet. So Trev got the tiller off, now he gets to take it home, sand it, and then I'll varnish it and we'll put it back on. Alright, so we're at, or I'm at home now I should say, and I went down to the gyro today and I found this old rusty job mate. I think it'll do the trick. I got a sander here, I'm gonna take a crack at doing this tiller. But yeah, look at this thing. It still works though. I picked it up for four whole dollars. It, it, it even spins still, kind of. So, we're gonna figure out how to make this work and we're gonna send a tiller. Alright. These are being a huge pain in the butt. I'm gonna go get it something bigger. All right, I'm back. I got it. So Trev's managed to get the tiller home and he's gone to the tool rental place in our small little town and rented us a nice uh, detail sander. So here he is doing all the hard work Well, I sit and watch and then maybe I'll varnish it for him. Well, for us I guess. Looks like Trev's got the tiller all sanded so he's going to get some more paper out and work on a couple of the other trim pieces from around the boat. Looks like everything's going to have to come off to get it all clean and nice underneath. So we quickly discovered that we're going to have to take all of this trim off and clean up behind it and clean the wood up itself, restain it, varnish it, and then we'll put it all back together and make it look all nice and pretty again. All right, so I unscrewed this little railing. I'm going to call it a cup railing because I have no idea what this part is called. I'm going to take it out and put it outside so we can sand it and varnish it. What is this thing called? What's that? What is this? Is it a stay? What's a halyard? What's a halyard? Uh, I don't really know. I can't remember right now. It's the thing that on the... Uh, is that the things that come off the... Yeah, the, the main the, pole, it's, yeah. What, What's this big pole in the middle called? The boom. Mast. Mast. <laughs> this is a boom. Yeah. Those are the halyards, halyards and the these are stays? That's a stay, yeah. It's a mast, yeah. Huh. Okay. Well, these are sausages. It's so good. <laughs> like this shit for days. I'm gonna try and get this middle wood piece out right here. Oh god. I don't know. I'm gonna wait for Trevor. I'm gonna feel a little defeated and <sighs> see if Trevor can crack that. I can't get that off, so I'm gonna kind of clean around it. All right, so we're gonna give these screws a shot. That Elizabeth didn't 
think that she could get out. She was having a hard time with that. All right, well, that's why she was having such a hard time with it. Get all the rust on those. Yep. Ooh. There we go. Look at that, another piece to take home for sanding. So JJ and I are on the boat. Hi. <laughs> and uh, we're gonna fix some cushions. We've got these cushions that go outside and I was gonna chuck them out until Trev made me sit on it and it's way better with the cushions. But one of them is fine and one of them is like this. And it's all like crappy old vinyl. And I would need probably like a walking foot on a sewing machine. It would be more, uh, it would break a lot of needles on my sewing machine. So. I decided to go the way of red green and repair this with good old duct tape. So, so here we go. So, I've repaired this white trash repairs, duct tape, who knew, right? Just gonna do the one that needs it for now. When the other one needs it, we'll do that then. Thanks so much. Thanks for watching our video, guys. If you liked it, you should hit that like button. And hit the little bell in the top corner and subscribe. Or share. And uh, watch us again next week with Sailing with the Care in the World. <laughs> See ya.